All right, uh, I'm Greg Armfield, nine star, three time lean. And, but I did, obviously I didn't start that way. Um, I started with uh, fitness and with weight loss, not nearly as much as she did, but, uh, <laughs> but I started uh, because I went to the doctor and I, when I turned 40 for that, that checkup that we all need to get. And uh, he said, you know, Greg, you're overweight and you have high blood pressure and you have high cholesterol and your sugar's high and I'm putting you on high blood pressure medicine and you need to start working out and start eating healthy. So I was like, oh crap, you know? <laughs> and what led me to that point was I got uh, fired from my job or let go, however you want to say it, um, a year before that. Um, basically, new executives came in and said, no, nah, we don't want these, these high-paid guys anymore, so they let me go. So that stress of finding a new job led to eating, not working out, working long hours. And uh, that, that doctor visit was a wake-up call. And uh, I saw a buddy of mine working, uh, doing P90X, and I said, you know, if he can do it, I can do it. So I started, it about killed me. But, uh, but I ended up losing uh, 45 pounds, and uh, I, I started drinking Shakeology, and I went back to the doctor six months later, and he said, you know, Greg, your transformation is amazing. He said, keep doing what you're doing. He said, I'm taking you off blood pressure medication. He said, all of your, you know, vitals, cholesterol, everything is back to normal. So, you know, keep doing what you're doing. So then I was like, Oh crap, now what am I going to do? <laughs> because, you know, how many of you all have been on diet programs and, you know, you did something and then it, it came right back, right? Or exercise programs, went to the gym. So I decided I would want to become a coach because, well, one, I wanted to save money on Shakeology, and two, I, I knew that if I had one person who was under me, that I, I would be accountable. And I would stay accountable. So when my coach signed me up, he, you know, he was telling me about all the millions of dollars I could make with Beachbody, and, and I was like, yeah, yeah, don't, don't, I told him, I said, don't expect anything out of me. And he stuck me on the inside leg under his wife. <laughs> so needless to say, that's now his strong leg. <laughs> But, you know, it, it started slow. I mean, I'm a slow and steady guy. So when I started five years ago as a coach, um, you have, they didn't even have challenge packs. You had to sign up. If you wanted two success club points, you had to sign up a coach with Shakeology. So that was my goal. You know, always get three coaches because that got me to SE5. Because my coach told me he was going on this cool trip to Atlantis in the Bahamas. And I was like, yeah, I wanna go with you to that. So my goal was to hit SE5 every single month. So I did. And along the way, I signed up however many coaches that year, you know? And then some of those coaches started to take off, you know? And my goal wasn't ever to make money, like I said. I mean, it, 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 when I started making money, I remember my first check was $37.50. But, uh, you know, eventually I started getting my uh, supplements paid for and my, my Shakeology paid for and my workout programs paid for. And I'm like, this is cool. I'm getting my hobby paid for, you know, deer. Isn't that cool? <laughs> and, uh, and then I started getting my car payment paid for and my, and, you know, my house payment paid for. And, you know, the thing that, that occurred to me is, you know, a, a lot of coaches say, well, your why needs to make you cry. And if, you, if it doesn't, then then you don't have a strong enough why. But you know, I can, I can tell you that my why has evolved, and I think most coaches' why has evolved. You know, my, my original why was to lose weight, you know, because, um, and get healthy, because you know, I, had both, I lost both my grandparents, my, my grandfather's, to uh, heart disease. I didn't even know my, my one grandfather, never met him. And I have teenage daughters who are not that far away from, you know, getting married and having kids of their own, and I wanted to be around for that. So, I mean, that was my original why, to get in shape. And then uh, my why changed to, 
Um, once I started making money at this business, I'm like, wow, this, you know, my coach wasn't selling me a, you know, a bill of goods that I, I really could make money at this. So then my why became, I want to save money so that I could send my, my daughters, who were teenagers, right, to college. So I would have a college savings fund because I never had that. I mean, I worked, but my wife didn't work. So you guys who are in that situation know that, you know, it's really hard to save money. So I, I, I was had a little savings, but nothing near enough to pay for, like, weddings for two daughters and, you know, college education for two daughters. So that was my goal. And, you know, in like four years, I was able to save $100,000 because of each body, which, right, which is life changing. And then I was able to retire from my full-time job. You know, I did that last January. <laughs> And now my, my why has changed, and you know, I, now I want financial freedom. I want to be able to work when I want, when I, where I want, you know, have the retirement paid for and, and everything else. So, you know, it keeps, keeps changing, and uh, you know, I want to encourage you guys to, to stick with it. It's, it was slow and steady. I mean, I worked the whole time up until last year, you know, 50 hours a week in this traffic, <laughs> you know, two-hour commute every single day. And, uh, and I did it, so that's my story. So you